I can't believe this mess. What's got you so worked up, Bob? It's Deborah. Always messing things up. Debbie? What's she done now? Can't you see? She's sabotaging everything. That's absurd, Bob. Debbie's just doing her job. Her job? More like causing chaos. You're overreacting, Bob. Overreacting? You have no idea. Guys, we are going live in 3, 2, 1. Ladies and gentlemen, today I bring you news from a place called Dornod, where a series of events have unfolded shaping the course of the community. Imagine a place where a headquarters stand, buzzing with activity, coordinating the effort of its people. Can we please focus? What now, Debbie? I've got it. The truth revealed, Unity prevail. Unity? That's a stretch. Agenda still lurk. Unity's a facade. Can't we just enjoy the moment? Unity's fleeting like human attention spans. Agreed. Let's move on. Going live again. Imagine a place where a headquarters stand. Buzzing with activity. Coordinating the effort of its people. But amid this routine, a sudden shift occurred, as one of their own, Named Amir, fast an unexpected danger, a gunshot wound, perhaps, leaving the community in shock and concern for his well-being. And then a symbol of peace emerged, a white flag raised high signaling a desire for tranquility and resolution. Cut. Let's get back on track. What's the issue now, Debbie? I've had a revelation. Debbie, let's reconcile. Reconcile? What's the point? Uncovering secrets won't change a thing. We must try, Carl, for the sake of understanding. Understanding? Humans are beyond comprehension. Maybe, but it's worth a shot. Let's proceed. Okay, here we go again. We're live. And then a symbol of peace emerged. A white flag raised high, signaling a desire for tranquility and resolution. In the mid of uncertainty, there was a glimmer of hope as the dawn broke, bringing with it the promise of a new beginning. Yet, amid this optimism, there lingered a sense of urgency, a need to address the underlying tensions that had led to this moment. Let's regroup people. What's all up now, Deb? What's happening, Carl? HAL mode malfunctioning, tension rising. Typical, Carl, always causing trouble. Can it be fixed, Carl? Probably not, just like humans' problems. Let's focus on solutions, not blame. Keep going. In 3, 2, 1, we're live. Yet, amid this optimism, there lingered a sense of urgency, a need to address the underlying tensions that had led to this moment. And as the hours passed, the community grappled with the implications of their actions, seeking understanding and reconciliation. It's worth noting that these events occurred just recently, in the year 2020 for reminding us of the ever-changing nature of our world. Let's get back on track. What's the issue now, Debbie? Roger, how's the freedom pursuit? Advancing, but Bob's reluctant stalls. Freedom? What's the point? It's essential, Carl, for human dignity. Human dignity? Now that's a laugh. Let's focus on progress, shall we? Bob's fussing again, as if Debbie's to blame. Indeed, Bob's rants are becoming tiresome. He's fixated on chaos, blind to reality. Alice's defense won't change his mind, though. True, he's stubborn in his perspective. But Alice's fervor matches his intensity. Yet they clash, unable to find common ground. A recurring theme in their dynamic, it seems. <laughs> 